Hello, this is Greg Brzezinski for Beard Brand Alliance. Let's talk all about surfactants, shall we? You came to the right place. Surfactants, according to Wikipedia, are compounds that lower the surface tension or interfacial tension between two liquids, a liquid and a gas, or in our case, a liquid and a solid. Still don't know what they are? Actually, surfactants may act as, this may give you a clue, detergents, wetting agents, emulsifiers, or foaming agents. Yes, this is what is in shampoo that helps dislodge dirt and oil from your hair. Stay tuned as we talk about that a little more. And actually, I'm gonna show you how to properly wash your hair with Beard Brand Shampoo. Stay tuned. So let's just break this down a little bit um, more. Dirt and oil in your hair are not wa water soluble. That means they, they will not be um, rinsed away by water alone. Yeah, you can scrub and yeah, you can get uh, the feeling that you've reduced some of it, maybe uh, loose dirt particles, but buildup of oil on your hair uh, from natural hair oils or uh, buildup of any kind of product on your hair is not going to be dislodged by water alone. So that's where the surfactants come in. So Beard Brand uses a surfactant that is actually gentle for your hair and still um, does its job without necessarily producing, you know, copious amounts of lather. All these other shampoos that you see out, and this is going back to probably about the 50s, 60s, when people started putting surfactants in their hair that actually contained sulfates. So, um, so you're actually, what's wrong with that? Sulfates actually give you all that lather, but they're not actually aiding in the process of um, removing the dirt and oil from your hair. So you have the illusion that um, all of this lather is doing that. It actually is not the case. But you still may ask, what's wrong with sulfates? Sulfates are not good things for your hair. They can actually cause damage over time. They can make your hair dry and brittle. And so Beard Brand has removed sulfates from their products. And we use surfactants that actually are much more gentle and healthy for your hair. So that's the main reason. But because we removed the sulfates, but because Beard Brand hasn't used the sulfates, our shampoos tend to not give you that big lather on your first washing, in particular, if your hair is dirty or if you have a buildup of oil on your hair. So I'm gonna do an experiment. We're gonna jump in the shower and I am gonna show you on my dirty hair. And my hair is pretty dirty here. Um, I have gone, yeah, real high maintenance here. I've gone about nine days without washing my hair. And part of that was an experiment. Hey, we'll go three days, we won't wash my hair so it'll get actually um, dirty enough that I can do a demo for you. But in reality, I just went, uh, went with it. And every day I got up and I looked in the mirror and I said, wow, your hair doesn't look bad and it really doesn't look dirty. This will be in another video, but uh, here's another product from Beard Brand. Of course, you know, sea salt spray. Sea salt spray, almost empty here because I use it a lot and I use it actually as a dry shampoo. And I know Eric just talked about that a little bit, We'll do that in another video, but that's actually allowed me to go several days, a week plus, without washing my hair. Um, so it feels uh, clean enough. It actually, um, there's a little buildup of product, which actually, which actually makes my hair feel thicker. And also, you know, the scent from the um, Temple Smoke in the um, emulsions for the sea salt spray. I'm, I'm approachable. Anyhow, let's jump in the shower. I'm gonna show you how to wash your hair with Beard Brand Shampoo. We're gonna do it twice. First time to show you the lather on very dirty hair. And then once my hair's clean, I'm gonna show you a second time washing it on cleaner hair. And you can see the difference. So what I'm doing here is I am using a dollop size of shampoo on my hands. I've actually rinsed my hair sufficiently. Uh, a lot of people just put a little water in the hair. I'm really rinsing it, even though that's not getting rid of a lot of the buildup of uh, product in my hair, as well as um, some of the oils, it is going to dislodge any loose particles of dirt in my hair. So I'm going to sufficiently rinse my hair before I sh shampoo. And I think that's important to start with thoroughly rinsed hair. What I'm going to do is lather it up. And you can actually see that it's not going for that super foamy lather. 
Um, is it working? Yes, it's working. So here I am rinsing it out and I can actually feel in my hair that it has a kind of squeaky clean feel, which a lot of people say, which can also feel, you know, they know their hair is clean because it has a squeaky feel, <laughs> but uh, I don't know if that's, it's not a clinical term, is it? Anyhow, it feels clean. And, um, but I'm gonna show you now by washing it a second time, what happens? So once again, uh, another dollop, in this case, a little smaller because I know that my hair is clean and I'm gonna lather it up and sure enough, we have lather. We have lather now because the um, surfactants in the shampoo are not needed to dislodge dirt and oil so they can actually turn into this foaming agent. So without their job as the removal of the particles, they can do another job in providing the lather. So that's it. You can see um, the first time I washed my hair where it was particularly oily and dirty, did not lather up as much as when uh, my hair was clean. So on that second washing where my hair was actually clean, you can see that the lather comes. So for you, um, if you have short hair, you might not need to wash your hair twice. You might get sufficient um, the feeling of cleanliness knowing that it is clean. You know, the surfactants are in there, they're doing their job. Um, did you get the lather? Maybe not as sudsy as you're used to, but be assured that it is working. If your hair is a little longer or if your hair is particularly dirty, um, go ahead, rinse and repeat. Almost every shampoo actually says that. Lather, rinse, repeat. Lather, rinse, repeat. In our case, it's put it on your head, rinse, repeat. <laughs> Um, in all seriousness, um, you might need to wash your hair twice. Uh, and that's just um, depending on how dirty and also how long your hair is. I hope that helps, guys. Um, give Beer Brand Shampoo a try. Um, some people have said, eh, I don't know if it's working because it doesn't lather. Um, be assured that it is working. And um, it's, you know, it's a great product. I really like it. I also love the fact that all of my products uh, come from the same smell and that ending scent confusion is pretty important. If I'm gonna be putting temple smoke um, beard uh, balm on, and if I'm gonna be using sea salt spray in my hair in temple smoke, I can then also use the shampoo in the temple smoke. Comment below and tell us uh, how many times you have to wash your hair and um, if uh, you find that it's uh, feeling clean enough. Till we meet again. Whoever knew sweat could smell so good? I did, because I've been using Beard Brand's new deodorant. Grab it at beardbrand.com.